Good morning, folks. T. Colson here. If you're like me and made the mistake of taking your Eachine I6 transmitter and resetting it to factory settings, you would find that you would no longer be able to bind to your Eachine 250 racer. So after hours of research on the internet trying to figure out how to get this thing to work, I figured out that you need to buy yourself a $5 binding plug and you need to rip down your Eachine racer to take out your receiver this plate is sticky taped to the receiver and I didn't want to rip it off because I want everything to be exactly where it was when I put it back together so all you got to do is just make sure that you can see the words upright set it down in front of you and take your binding plug to female end and plug it in okay let's see to the first row of pins like such and to power this thing I used the regular quadcopter battery and uh, the charging plug you just when you hook it up you make sure the red wire is on the inside so I'll hook that up real quick it's hard to do this holding the camera too and once you do that <clears throat> sorry you're gonna notice the light flashing quickly so now you're gonna power up your transmitter and what you're gonna do is you're gonna hold down your bind button which is right there and turn it on at the same time And it should be binding. Well, I just I just did it so, and the light's blinking slow like it's supposed to. So now, once it's blinking slow like that, you remove the power, remove the binding plug. and turn the transmitter off now I'm going to put the battery back in its spot red wire in and you're going to see the light is flashing slow I'm going to turn the transmitter on and it stopped I'm bound to it and now I'm going to put everything back together and mess with the Libra Pilot program and once I figure things out in there I'll put up another video for you folks thanks for watching peace